The following is a selected video from yourteacher.com where you can browse over 450 complete math lessons with example videos, interactive practice problems, self-tests, and more. Try a complete lesson today at yourteacher.com. To evaluate this problem, the first thing we want to do is plug in the appropriate values for A and C. When we do that, we get negative 2 squared minus a negative 6 all over negative 6 plus 2 times negative 2. A good rule of thumb for problems that involve division bars is to simplify what's above the division bar as much as you can and what's below the division bar as much as you can before you do your dividing. So up top if we follow our order of operations the first thing we want to do is square this negative 2 before we subtract. So negative 2 squared is positive 4 minus a negative 6. Down below we want to multiply before we add so 2 times negative 2 is negative 4 so we have negative 6 plus negative 4 down below. Up top, minus a negative can be thought of as plus a positive. 4 plus 6 is positive 10. Negative 6 plus negative 4 is negative 10. And positive 10 over negative 10 is negative 1.